Hey, this is Eric and Tammy with Techno RV. And as you may know, we're from the Gulf Coast of Alabama, and we love uh, our home area uh, because of all the uh, water. We've got Mobile Bay, we've got uh, some of the most beautiful beaches and Gulf Shores and uh, Orange Beach. Dolphin Island. We love it. And uh, we also uh, love the weather because right now it's December the 7th and it's 65 degrees outside. Right. Shorts and t-shirts. Works and, for us. Yeah, shorts and t-shirt. And uh, so we wanted to show you uh, one of the best RV resorts that we found uh, in this area. It's Bella Terra of Gulf Shores and it's in Foley, Alabama. And, uh, and we just love it here. So what are some of your favorite things uh, about this resort? Uh, I like the location that it's not right in the middle of the touristy part of Gulf Shores, um, but it's close enough that it's just a short drive. I mean, it's just a couple miles to get to Target and Publix and restaurants and beach and all that type of stuff. Um, so you're not right in the middle of everything, but the grounds are gorgeous. I mean, the landscaping is incredible. Um, the clubhouse and everything is quiet and just a good yeah. place to relax. It's really a good place to uh, to treat yourself to just a nice RV resort, uh, and, and also what we found is you can actually uh, buy lots in here. And oh, there's and, some fine lots. Yeah, there. <laughs> kind of create your own kitchen area and uh, gazebos yes. and, and casitas and all that kind of uh, neat kind of thing. And uh, so we found that there's people here uh, that just come for the winter time, mm -hmm. and uh, but the summers are great here too. And uh, we just want to show it all to you. So again, Bellaterra at Gulf Shores in Foley, Alabama. Let's go take a look at it. All right. I like parts with big wide lanes to get the RV in when you pull in. And this has that. And you basically just pull up right to the office uh, for check-in. So that makes it real easy. And here we are checking in. Come in, we were greeted nicely. And what I really liked about it was uh, they actually take in sit you down and talk to you about the park and where everything's located. Yeah, I don't think that's ever happened before. Normally they just give you the booklet you leave and you kind of on your own. And when you're done in the office, they just lead you right out to your spot. So uh, that makes it nice. There's a lot of different uh, lots to choose from. There's some on the lake. Uh, there's pull-throughs. Uh, so yeah, you just get with the front office about that when you make your reservation. And uh, here's a lot right on the lake with a casita on it. And a lot of these are uh, lots are owned, and then the office just rents these out. So a lot of them are appointed quite nicely with outside kitchens and casitas and things like that. It also has a practice putting green and I think a bocce ball um, little field. You can kind of see all the different uh, sites that are available on the map. Um, not all of them are built. There are. Um, a few under construction so when you purchase one you kind of get to design it yourself what type of kitchen you want if you want a casita if you want a gazebo and they kind of let you really design it yeah and there's uh, laundry rooms uh, in different areas there's a pet park and uh, so you know it's kind of got all the things that you would expect out of a, a nice RV resort and uh, they really did a good job putting these together as far as uh, not only the layout but kind of the niceties uh, or the quality of, of workmanship of the buildings and things like that around the park. Yeah, there are several different laundry stations with private bathrooms. They're even adding a dog wash, which is really convenient, especially for those with larger dogs. But um, let's look at the clubhouse now. It was just fabulous. It's right when you kind of enter the park. It's the first thing you see. Uh, just the inside is really well appointed and, and, and well decorated. All right, we're in the Bellaterra Clubhouse now. One of the best we've ever seen, right? Oh, yeah, this is nice. So, uh, we're gonna show you around, and they've got a great fitness area that we discovered a few days into actually being here. We were like, what have we been thinking? I mean, they've right. got everything. Not, I mean, the walk around the, the park is beautiful because the landscaping was wow. Yeah. The fitness room's got everything. The sauna, even got like a, it's like a massage table. Got a massage table, uh, uh, free weights, it's got the universal weight machine. And the view while you're working out is the pool and the lake and everything. It's beautiful. Yeah, so the fitness area is uh, top notch. My favorite is the movie theater room. Yeah, it's incredible. <laughs> they've got this movie theater room and it's like they've got the stacked seating and uh, the screen is, I don't know, as big as, a, big as the whole wall in yeah, there. Yeah, that would be fun. And I know they have movie nights. Uh, in there, and then 
I presume you can just bring your own movie up here anytime you want to. Yeah, they have things scheduled um, on the calendar, things like overnight. So it's a great community. They always have things scheduled for you to um, do on the weeknights and everything. So it's, it's got a good community feel to it that people just get together and hang out. And today's poker night. Today's poker night. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, and it's got this little bar area. It's got a nice uh, kitchen area. And uh, that we looked at, mm -hmm. and it's got kind of everything you need to have a little party. And to Tammy's point, they just kind of have parties anyway for the, the community right. from time to time. And outside the pool area is fabulous. It's got a, um, the infinity, the, the infinity, infinity pool. Infinity pool is what it's called. But they have an outdoor grill. They have an outdoor kitchen area. A lot of seating, so you can have events with your friends and family big outside. Fire pit. Got a big fire Huge pit. Fire pit yep. yeah. Overlooking the lake, so the view is just gorgeous. Yeah, so it all kind of makes sense, mm -hmm. and, uh, and it's uh, decorated for Christmas right now because mm -hmm. it's, uh, like we said, it's, it's December, so uh, it's this is one of the best clubhouses that we've seen. There's a lot of good ones out there. Yes, there are. And this, uh, one. and this one, this one ranks up there at the top of them. our stay at Bellaterra, we had an opportunity to actually visit their sister site, Reunion Point. It is an RV port home community where you can actually have your motorhome and your home together uh, and you share a courtyard. Yeah, I mean, this is a motorhome community and you basically build uh, a house and they work with you to do this that incorporates your motorhome. It's got full hookups, obviously. And uh, it's just incorporated into the whole house. You can open the house up directly to the RV. There's that outdoor kitchens uh, that are right there in between basically your RV and the home. You can get uh, one or two bedrooms. Uh, and they really work with the customers. They work with a uh, builder out of Fairhope, Alabama that really does great work. Yeah, the neat thing I liked is that because they share the courtyard, you really can kind of stay in the RV and let people stay in the house or stay in the house and let people stay in the RV and it's really just in the same common area because you share the courtyard. Uh, there were so many different um, variations of the houses we saw because again you get to design your house as far as colors, there were people that chose different bathroom types, all the bathrooms were beautiful, but there's just a lot of um, versatility as far as your cabinet color and everything that you could choose to make it feel uh, even more at home. Yeah, I mean, they're called port homes, and, and honestly, I've just never seen anything like this before. Uh, and I, I actually put it in a search engine, and this is the one that comes up. So, uh, you know, if you're looking for a home base in a great area of Baldwin County, Alabama, real, right by the beaches, and uh, need a place for your motor home, and then you like to travel, then uh, your motor home's always there. Yeah, and I think they have a rental program for this as well where when you're not at your house, you can actually rent your port home out um, on the times you travel. Yeah, and they, you know, there's a lake, uh, they're building a clubhouse, and uh, it's really just a great community uh, for, for motorhomes. So you can uh, contact them, uh, uh, Reunion Point is the name, and uh, they'll schedule you a, uh, a tour or talk to you on the phone about it.